here. Coming to you guys live from thermal boxing. It is raining. But we're still out here fixing the gym. Here, babe. Just leave my phone. Okay, we camera. got all, also out here. Camera's up? on you. What's up? Get these guys out here that are doing the work. They came from Anaheim. Okay, but what? introduce and tell them. Tell them what? You hey, Southsider. You just did. You told them. We're in thermal. Southsider said hi. What's up, Southsider? We're out here painting the gym. Good, good gym morning, you guys. Oh, now it's off me? Oh. Good morning, you guys. Good morning, everybody. A quick live just to show you guys what's going out here in thermal boxing. We have Kathy and her family out here that blessed us with paint and with their labor work. Here you go, Kathy. Hello, hi everybody. <laughs> also, get over here. And this is the man, you guys. Emilio here, he uh, owns his uh, own painting company, so him and his wife and kids came and donated labor, paint. They're scraping the gym. We even got rain right now. This is a huge blessing, you guys. Give us a thumbs up, comment, like, and share this video. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's stopping to sprinkle. We got a generator over here going on. But this is it, you guys, they're here. My dog's even here. Also. <laughs> also. Say hi, Bob Bites. We're working today, you guys. blessing not only to us but to the kids out here in Thermal to this community <clears throat> I just wish and Mark's probably going to get mad at me but I just wish that you know the kids that do work out at this gym and the coaches that do work here you know to help out I know everybody has a busy life and things to do, but I just wish we had more help, more hands. There you go again, babe. Why do you have to be that way? Who cares? Come on, well, you're going live with it now. You think, end it already. Please, that's not me. Tell them why, I'm acting like that. Explain to them. No, you do it. You start it. You open it. Mm. Okay, I'll do it. Because you put it out there already. What's up, guys? So this morning I got a Gina again because she feels a certain way about people not coming out and helping. And I keep telling her it don't matter. No. It doesn't matter if people come out. You know what I mean? It hurts her feelings though to see that the community out here, with all the gyms we have and, and the valley being small, that is a family out of Anaheim. That's out here for two days to get this job done. And to me, I tell her, there's going to be 20 devils out there and three angels. Be happy and thankful and blessed for those three angels and stop worrying about the fucking 20 devils that aren't doing shit. It's a metaphor. It just, it, it, it's, it's, it, it's just, it doesn't matter who doesn't come. My mom always told me, 
Stop worrying about people coming in and out of your life. Because if you worry about that and who stays, you're always going to be disappointed. Worry about yourself. Be loyal to yourself. Stay your own ground. Stand your own ground. Right? Ten toes down. Hold your own. Be loyal to yourself and you'll never be disappointed. You know what I mean? I'm here. My son was here this morning. They're here. Chip's coming out. Otto was buying all the uniforms for the kids, suiting them up. Chip Flores is doing the lettering on the building. We have enough already. We don't need any more. If somebody like to come out and, and help rake or sleep, or we got Lowe's coming out. Uh, Danny, the manager from Lowe's, is going to donate some materials. I'm thinking some plants so we can put around the gym and make it look presentable with the new paint and the new lettering. Right? That's enough, man. We got plenty. We got more than enough. So I just try to tell G, I'm not changing her. I don't want to change her. G is who she is. She's hard. You know what I mean? You, you screw her over once, that's it. You don't get second chances. With me, you get three, four, five second chances or third chances because I was given. This old man, when he met me, my life was falling apart. I had already been through four chances in my life to still be here, and he'd give me my fifth. Six years later, here I am, changing lives, walking out, giving back to the community on my fifth chance in life. Fifth. So do I believe in chances? Hell yeah. Do I believe handling it myself instead of waiting for somebody to come through? Hell yeah, I do. You know that we have a generator now because a man reached out to me yesterday and messaged me, said he saw a video of ours and that he didn't know they sold our generator. He delivered a brand new generator kids to have lights until we get our power back on and these guys will have a generator to play. we did that yesterday on the last day the day before they came out we were going to rent a generator we still have to buy a generator to replace the one that was sold from the man who owned it to us so the money that we're raising on the raptor we're going to purchase the generator to get back to the man that owned it to us in our, in, in, in our uh, Using it was stolen. So, is God good? Hell yeah. Did he provide? Hell yeah. Do I believe and have faith? Hell yeah. You have to be honest with yourself on why you do what you do in this world, but don't do it at all. And this is all for the kids. This is why you do it. For the kids. You know what I mean? So, sorry. For the, for the cop or me having a claim some shit, but I just told you on what she said, you know, we're, we're going to see how many people come out, I posted it, and so I had to stop her again and say, stop worrying about people coming out, I have a rake, I have a shovel, I'll rake, I'll shovel, I'll clean up the yard if I have to. it should have been done a long time ago, but being busy and all that we do in our lives, all the things, um, sometimes I have to prioritize what gets done and what doesn't, uh, this is overdue. This is this is very well needed right now. And this is what we're gonna focus on. And when this is done, then I'll move on to the next one we have. And that's uh the house in the back. We have to get the house ready for We have to move on to the house in the back so we can rent it out. And uh, yeah, so many projects man. But I think the I think the kids really deserve this one. So I appreciate all you guys out there listening and watching and supporting. And, and you guys got to remember this family. Always, always think when something's down in your life or you're feeling uh, uh, like something's not, you're, it's not possible, I guess, right? It's not possible. Something's going on. Stop and think about, show them this family. Look at these angels. Look at these people out there that come through. It's husband and wife. And it's Kathy Martinez, her kids, her husband. Very appreciative of this family. I'm gonna I'm going to head home because I have some costitas con chile. I'm making frijoles charros. I'm making a pasta salad, salsas, um, chicharron con chile, gorditas de chicharron con chile. So I have a lot of cooking to do. 
and um, and this is just like out of my heart because this is amazing I'm just lost for words and uh, like Mark said you know I'm a little bit more hard and I see life for what it is and I should duct tape my mouth because sometimes you know I can say a little bit too much but that those were my feelings you know but I guess like he says you know you're gonna get three angels out of 20 devils so I'll work with that but thank you guys for tuning in thank you for all the love and support and uh, I'm gonna go and get some stuff ready for them for for lunch and see you guys on our next live thank you for tuning in everybody have a blessed day blessed week blessed month blessed year we love you guys for always being here prayers 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 and you guys pray for me because sometimes my my heart's ugly you guys so i need a lot of prayer please pray for me Thank you guys, and uh, we'll see you guys later. Oh. Sorry. Hard work, hard work. <laughs> hard work. No pain, no gain. Look at it, I'm still scraping. Stay by me. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Say bye because we're gonna. Uh, I'm. I have to go cook. Okay. Bye, Kishesko. Cook. <laughs> See you guys. Thanks a lot for tuning in, though.